Good evening. Here are some of the stories to expect tomorrow, the 23rd of May 2024. This is tomorrow's news today. We begin with our national stories. Africa must re-examine the democracy inherited from the West, says Obasanjo. Obi visited the Labour Party for reconciliation and not to endorse anyone, says Tanko. Ministers will begin a public performance review on May 23rd, says Mohamed Idris. In one year, Nigeria has witnessed significant progress under Tinubu, according to Akume. Ganduje says that the All Progressives Congress is being strengthened for Tinubu's re-election in 2027. Cross River Assembly in Oraudi session as House impeaches Speaker for misappropriation. Chijioke Edioga faults Enugu demolition and says that the government is insensitive. Tinubu appoints Sheu Mohammed as core marshal of the Federal Road Safety Corps. The Namdiazikwe University readjusts its convocation date over alleged threats by the indigenous people of Biafra IPOB and the movement for the actualization of the sovereign state of Biafra Masob. Police rescued the two abducted daughters of Zamfara lawmaker. Undo teenager backs 14 years for raping a student. From business. The Federal Inland Revenue Service blames the Nigerian Correctional Service for failing to produce the Binance Executive in court for arraignment. Investors are responding positively to the Central Bank of Nigeria's transparency, says Cardoso. Jigawa states to produce 27% of Nigeria's rice this year, says the governor. From Tech News. The Nigeria Communications Commission begins public inquiry to review the regulations on telco disconnection and dispute resolution. Coming from entertainment, federal government bans money ritual, smoking and crime scenes in Nollywood films. Portable declares himself police ambassador days after arrest. From the international space, United Kingdom University orders Nigerian students to leave school and the country over unpaid fees. The federal government signs a memorandum of understanding with UTEL to help Nigerians get at least 250 foreign jobs. Ireland, Norway and Spain to recognize Palestine as independent state. From the interesting world of sports, Eagles won't play defensive football. We have high-caliber players, says Finidi. Budapest to host the UEFA Champions League final in 2026. For the details of the stories and more interesting content, do visit our official website at guardian.ng or pick up a copy of our newspaper from your closest newsstand. Also, don't forget to follow us on all our social media platforms at Guardian Nigeria. Khalid Bada is my name. Bye for now.